For those that haven't seen the fight, explain to us what happened. You know what? I, I got caught early, which is gonna happen when you, when you, you know, my fight style, I trade, man. So we went in there, I traded. He landed his, his first shot. I came back with a flurry. Uh, I cut him pretty bad in the first round. And then I feel like I just pushed the pace. And you know, I, I feel like I won the fight. What was it like with all that blood in there? Was it hard uh, to, to grapple? Because you guys were just pretty much standing and banging. I, I didn't see too many uh, clinches. You know what? Uh, he wanted to clinch, and I wasn't going to let him feel comfortable. Every time he tried to clinch me, I'd break away or I'd push him against the fence. Uh, you know, I cut him with some really bad elbows. Um, but, you know, I, I, I take a lot of pride in putting on a great show. I'm not just trying to eke out a victory. Uh, I want to put on a great fight every time I fight. So. Why don't you show us that cut you got? How's yeah, that man. You know what? Th that cut happened on a headbutt. So that came when we clashed heads. So, you know what? It's gonna happen, you're gonna clash heads, but you know, he got like three or four real cuts all over his face from elbows. But you know, he's a tough guy and he, he's a really great guy to fight. A lot of respect and a lot of love. Fight of the night by far, tell us how you're feeling. I feel pretty good. A um, little cut up here, I got 30 stitches, but other than that, I feel good. So tell us what was going on out there in the, in the opening rounds, man. You dropped him. Uh, I dropped you rocked him. him hard with a straight left. Well, it looked like I knew what I, I knew he was gonna throw the the V left hook and he was gonna throw the overhand right. So I was waiting for the overhand right. When he did, I just shot him with a straight left and dropped him and uh, jumped on top of him. I tried to finish him. You know, I tried to rear naked choke him. Maybe I should have tried to strike him a little bit more, but I, I really thought I was gonna get him with the rear naked. But uh, he defended really well, really well. How tough was he in there? Very tough. He's real strong. Uh, when he pulled me, uh, pulled, pulled me into my guard, he hit me with his el elbows. That's what cut me. In fact, I had blood going in my eyes. I couldn't see anything. I was in blood in my eyes, my nose, my mouth. I couldn't breathe. I couldn't see. So it, it made it kind of hard. You got to let me take a look up close at some of these cuts, man. Can yeah. you tell us which, which, or what these cuts came from? Elbows. When he was in my guard, right in the first round, he hit me with the elbows. So all those are from elbows? Elbows. And he said, uh, I think you cut him pretty good up of the top. Yeah, of hit him with a straight left, cut him in his, uh, cut him over his eye. <laughs> We're both bleeding pretty bad. My nose was clogged up from the blood, so I was having trouble breathing. I was having to breathe through my mouth, so it kind of affected my breathing a little bit. But uh, other than that, I felt, I felt good. I felt strong. I was ready to fight.